Hello, everybody. Uh, my name is Sajjad Zulfikar. I'm a PhD student of Urbanum from Iran University of Science and Technology. Uh, it's a big honor for me to represent my uh, research uh, to in uh, ISHB 2020 conference. I hope to stay safe from COVID-9 uh, pandemic. And uh, I want to say a special thanks to my uh, supervisor, Dr. al Sobi and Dr. Mufi for guiding me for this research. <clears throat> okay, let's start. Uh, our research is about investigation of um, Catalyst project and uh, urban design qualities in six central streets of Hamadan. As you know, streets are uh, like a vein in the body and play an important role in uh, whole cities. And these crucial elements are so essential in each city's uh, structure, the primary rule uh, roots of the city can quickly figure out by the distribution of cities uh, street. Um, Hamadan is a mountainous city in west of Iran, uh, which is shaped in circle form that is unique in our uh, in our country or Middle East. Uh, this uh, unique structure is exceptional in Iran, as, as I said, and, and this paper tries to uh, figure out the differences between the uh, this street uh, catalyst in, uh, intervention and car driving streets. Uh, also comparing these two types of street and, and the result can help our urban management and city responsible. Uh, catalyst project uh, are some intervene that uh, to inject new spirit um, in target area. These um, action are trying to respond to further uh, further people's need uh, based on the, the context and general I identity. Uh, the research methodology is uh, quantitative based on uh, HP uh, technique uh, to uh, uh, specify six uh, streets and priority and interpret differences uh, between catalyst project and car driving street. Okay. <clears throat> Um, increasing, uh, increasing urban design uh, qualities are essential issue in cities, um, especially in primary uh, in primary elements like uh, squares and uh, street. A street a crucial role in whole structure towns and improving their quality can lead uh, the growth better. Uh, the main uh, question. Uh, is that uh, the main question is that does uh, any catalytic reaction improve um, or uh, improve the circumstances of the central streets of Hamadan? Uh, and uh, do these changes are uh, overlapping in user uh, users' uh, mindsets? As you see in the slide, and uh, this is the Imam score of Hamadan that has uh, six uh, streets uh, and, and these uh, two of them uh, change their role uh, by uh, making them uh, workable and um, and this. So uh, the literature review, uh, so many um, research about urban design quality in the world and uh, for our context, uh, we use uh, uh, urban design quality that uh, drive and drive um, and this criteria: vitality, uh, transportation issues, uh, flexibility, compatibility, and uh, functional dynamics. An urban catalyst um, or catalyst projects. Um, catalyst project are latest approach of. Uh, approach to improve all types of urban uh, in urban environments. And this approach has been changed from giant project to small, small scale urban design project, uh, which increased social interaction and uh, cultural prosperity in uh, urban spaces. Um, the hypothesis is, uh, it seems that improving quality by catalyst project in central parts of Hamadan uh, can provide better uh, urban life for citizens and the importance of the 
of this question can make uh, urban ma urban manager and right uh, managers the right decision and, uh, and the decision for urban spaces in the future uh, research uh, methodology the research met uh, methodology and uh, that i said in the first slide is based on a uh, quantitative method uh, that is performed by amp techniques uh, the model came from a literature review and indicators and derived from the study of research keywords then uh, for accuracy and the indicator are divided into sub indicators um, <coughs> and uh, to investigate the alternatives better uh, also the judgment were obtained by interview interviewers uh, and observations of the cases uh, moreover, the user comment attitude has uh, formed the uh, assessment uh, of all criteria and alternative in the search model and besides uh, the inconsistency is less than uh, 0.1 uh, in all comparisons. Uh, <coughs> research uh, uh, methodology in uh, graph. The data model and data and model analysis, uh, as you see, uh, we have a goal for uh, increasing um, urban, urban quality for urban, by urban design and new approach like catalyst and uh, the criteria and that we said uh, before, um, compatibility, compatibility, functional dynamics in, tra in transportation issues, vitality and flexibility and sub criteria like in uh, compatibility, accessibility, permeability, permeability uh, walkability and uh, all likes uh, as you see. And in alternatives, uh, we have uh, six street, uh, Baba Tahir, Bu Ali street, Ekbaton, Shariati, Shohada and Tahti. Uh, <clears throat> Uh, limitation is uh, due to the COVID-19 pandemic and the interview um, has some uh, problem and uh, uh, interviews uh, and operation were, for, uh, were faced with some troubles and the research controls the process of uh, study because the study were such crowded and populated spaces. And in conclusion, <laughs> Uh, Buali and Ekbaton Street are the um, uh, first and second priority in AHP model. Uh, and uh, in, in HP model analysis com and uh, compatible with the theoretical paper concept. The people's mindset approved that the catalyst uh, anger may increase the city's elements qualities and grow better with well and this is certain this study contributes for the first time using the amp uh, method and to specify urban elements uh, rates and to the urban cattle field uh, beside urban management and easily find the right way to improve city score and finally i can say that uh, <clears throat> these two uh, first and second uh, priorities uh, are uh, as same as uh, these uh, the new uh, changes in um, this street. They are walkable and the social interaction are more on, uh, on them and uh, so many activities carried and on uh, these, uh, how I can say, quality feature are uh, equal with uh, people mindsets. So you've got about a minute and left. See, okay. The right one is Ali Street and this uh, left is Ekbaton Street. These are key references. And thank you for watching. Thank you, Sajad. Any questions from the um, participants for about this presentation? Well, I uh, don't have a question, but I have 
I have to say that's a beautiful city that you live in. My goodness, your central square and the buildings are it amazing. A, it is a historic city in West of Iran that Avicenna has died in it. And we have a, a historical tomb in our city, Avicenna tomb. And, when, um, when do you think those buildings were built around your central square? Uh, I, you know, the, this central square uh, has been made by uh, German uh, German architecture. Uh, I think uh, Karl Frisch in uh, in a ninety, I can say ninety ninety uh, fifty six, and uh, this type of is uh, unique in our country. And I said in Middle East because these are rings. Uh, um, um, around the city and is a um, example of a circle of the world. I see. I, I do have a comment about your study. If you could What's show that? again your model, I'd just like to say something about AHP models versus ANP models. AMP. Okay. Yeah. One, one thing I often say when I'm talking about it is that ANP models don't have goals. Let me see if I can explain why. When you have the goal, you are imagining more or less the importance of the criteria. You're saying, well, I know. And you go ahead and pairwise compare and get the priorities. A better way to get the priorities is to remove that goal altogether and then how do you get the priorities of the criteria? You have to connect the nodes in the next level down back to the criteria. For example, accessibility in traffic issues sub-criteria should be connected back to the criteria. And what does accessibility, what are the most important criteria with respect to accessibility. I'm not sure that's the best one to uh, talk about. Uh, which, which is the most important criterion to have for accessibility? Is it compatibility or functional dynamics or traffic use or vitality or flexibility? Those are pairwise comparisons that you make with respect to accessibility. So you have an arrow going back up to the criteria. Do you see I, what I mean? Yes, you mean that uh, in AMP model we have to uh, cross out the goal, or in, uh, or because uh, we have uh, five uh, criteria, we uh, we didn't need uh, we don't need um, goal. Each of them is true. Yeah, it's a, a kind of a better way overall because you get a lot of perspectives about what the criteria are good for. Um, and you can try it with your very model. You don't have to throw away your model. You can uh, try removing the goal. And you don't have to connect all the sub-criteria back. If, if they don't fit, it doesn't make sense. You don't do it. Um, so anyway, that's a nice study. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you for your comments. Great suggestion there from Roseanne again about the units and the interaction of the. That was a good, good summary of ANP. <laughs> Other questions? Thank you. Hi. I, I have a, a, a question for Sajid. Uh, this is a very nice study. Congratulations. But uh, what, what I can see you have uh, in clusters, uh, for example, in functional dynamics sub criteria, in that cluster you have two, uh, just two elements, and you have a feedback loop. What, why did you need those uh, feedback loops? What, what, what's the meaning of those feedbacks? Because it seems to me, and correct me if I, I'm wrong, uh, uh, you're transferring the weight uh, or the influence of one element to, to the other. Uh, so I thought it that wouldn't it... be enough to just have one 
uh, element instead of two? Um, and just chorus. Uh, I thought that uh, in AMP model, we have to uh, uh, references all um, criteria and elements to each other. At least, uh, I think um, false uh, hypothesis from me, uh, false attitude uh, from me. Uh, I think you're right. Um, it sh I should uh, use the feedback, may use this uh, feedback in this uh, functional dynamic criteria. You're right. Thank you. Yeah, that's an interesting, interesting comment. A good follow up there, um, Luis. So our, our time is um, up. I, one, one quick thing. The Creative Decisions Foundation has a lot of tutorials about ANP on YouTube. Go and look at the Creative Decisions Foundation uh, channel. It, okay. it has good suggestions. Sorry. Okay, sure. Sure, I do it. <laughs>